I'm Vera Wang, and I'm a designer. From top to toe, Rick Allen Men's, Christopher Rayburn Army Surplus, we worked. Rick Owen and the Mule Easter. And last but not least, Asadina Lyle on my shoes. You know, she really is the gold standard, the pace car, you know, as it were, for bridal. So she can kind of do whatever she wants and the rest of the world follows. You know, Vera has a pretty modern sensibility, so we all try to align ourselves with that. I'm wearing um, a majestic t-shirt. They're the softest t-shirts, I only wear these. The skirt is um, a Vera Wang collection skirt. My shoes are uh, Nicholas Kirkwood. I just love high heels. <laughs> I work with some of the most fashionable girls around. I have to admit, um, I, I love what everybody wears here and everyone has their own unique style and they really do dress to represent their personal aesthetic and their taste level. So I think it's, I think it's great to work in an environment where people really um, the way that they dress is a reflection of who they are. So uh, the blazer is Sandro, and then I'm wearing a uh, Marnie cardigan underneath, and Ralph Lauren polo. Um, jeans are acne, and the shoes are Lama. So I would say that on a Friday when we don't have a lot going on, we might dress down, if you will, which means that I might not wear a collar, for example, but I'm certainly not casual um, by any sense of the word. I spend so much time around clothes, and with clothes all day, every day that for me, getting dressed in the morning has to be very easy. I can't be thinking about color all the time for myself when I have to be thinking about color for the runway. Mostly, I find my fashion in texture, whether it's sheer or massive amounts of beading and embroideries and all that sort of thing, and it just feels rich without feeling overwhelming to me. Top down, Vera Wang. Rick Owens, this is vintage Vera. All Saints jeans and Alaya shoes. I did wear a lot of black before, but um, I would say that being in this environment and, and having Vera as uh, someone to look up to, you know, certainly influences the way that I think about you know, what I pick out. I generally wear a lot of black because I like it, but it also is um, sort of a, a work uniform. You know what happens? I think people just feel comfortable. You know, fashion people are a little overwhelmed by fashion. Let's not forget, you know, it's coming at you all the time. We read about it, you study it, you think about it, you're looking at fabrics, you're looking at it all day long. At some point, you're just tired. And black is easy, you know? But it's not to say it's a black t-shirt and a black pant every day or a, or a sort of black banker suit. It's not, if we're doing black, it's not that, you know? It's always with some kind of twist or flair or fun or as I was saying earlier, texture, or some interesting shape, you know? That, that's, that's how I do black, that's how my colleagues here do black, you know. But it's true, we wear a lot of black. 